how to connect shopify to printful hi guys welcome back to another video and in this video i'm going to be telling you how you can connect your shopify on your printful account so having said that let's just jump into the video so for those of you who didn't know printful is a print on demand website where you can create amazing looking clothes and all you have to do is upload your design and leave everything else to printful so they're going to be handling the shipping they're going to be handling the manufacturing the advertising of the product everything all you have to do is just simply upload the product and these are all the available platforms that you can connect printful to and you have shopify over here you have etsy woocommerce wix.com squarespace and all of that so let's get started so first things first what you're going to need to do is you're going to need to sign up onto printful so uh to sign up all you have to do is either click on the sign up button then you can access the regular account but if you want to you know sell on printful then you want to scroll down and you want to click on print on demand over here so simply click over here to their place where you can you know start creating your services so just simply click on let's go over here and just simply click on sign and then just sign up so you can sign up with either facebook with google or with apple or you can sign up with your email address i'm going to go ahead and sign up with google because it's a lot easier and it saves quite a lot of time as well and boom you are good to go then you have created your account now this was an old account that i just logged into but basically you're good to go so over here you have your checklist so you have to sign up on for Printful, you have to confirm your email. You have to create a product template, connect your store, add a product to your store, take care of billing and order samples. All right. So these are all the things that you need to do. So as you can see, I already completed this. So let me just go ahead and show you. So the first two, you can do this on your own. And the second one, you need to create a product template, right? So come over here onto the left side and you will see product template over here underneath orders. So simply click on product template and it's going to take you over here where you can upload your design to create a product template. So I've already created these. Let me just go ahead and create one more to show you how I basically do it. So simply click on create more product and it's going to ask you which type of products you are trying to create so either men's clothing women's clothing kids and youth accessories hats brands you know home and living collections and all of that you can choose whichever one you want and then your branding is going to be over them so i'm going to choose men's clothing and over here all men's clothing all shirts jackets hoodies or specific ones as well so uh, i basically want like let's say all men's clothing and then it's going to take you over to this part of the website where you just have to you know do it so as you can see these are printful suggestions that you can try over here these are some of the best sellers over here so let's go ahead and do that so over here let's choose this one right here this product the shirt and over here you have to drop your design dtg printing all right so over here drop your design you can have like embroidery as well so uh, if you choose whichever technique you want it depends on you so it will for dtg printing it'll be just a printing and embroidery if you choose embroidery it's going to be you know stitched into it so it's much more high quality so it all depends on you so let's go ahead and upload our design real quick so let me just see over here if i have one so i had a couple of one but i never completely created them so let's just upload these glasses that i created all right it's gonna upload over here there you go wait for a couple of seconds for it to load up and boom there you go so that's how it looks like all right that's about your design you can go ahead and increase it or you can move it about but since you are using like embroidery then it's gonna be you know staying over here you can't change that so what you can do is you can like make it bigger and smaller but it all depends on you and yeah over here is going to be your color as you can see when it's embroidered that's how it looks like it's like cool little glasses so you can zoom in all right so it's really cool now that that's done we can go ahead and transform it position it you know center chest whatever you want and if you wanted to change it you can go ahead and print it as well but i think embroidery looks much much better so let's go ahead and click on continue and boom we have our product right here over here you can add in the product template and click on save the product template this way all of the products are going to be like this so you don't have to worry about it there you go i have a product template what's next next you have to connect to your store all right so over here on the left side you have a bunch of different options so you have your warehouses you have your billing you have your stores file library and all of that click on store and over here it's going to take you over to this part of the website where you have to choose the platform that you want to create so i already created it with wix account with my wix website but for now as i said the topic is to connect it to our shopify store right 
So over here, you can choose the platform. But before we do that, we need to have like a Shopify account. So let's go ahead and sign up. And for this one, I'm going to be using a temporary email. So I'm going to go ahead and copy this email. I'm going to paste it over here and I'm going to click on 14 day trial. All right. And then I'm going to enter in the password and then I'm going to click on create your store. It's going to create my store and we can move on. And now you have to choose. Are you already selling? Um, just playing around. You can go ahead and choose whichever option you want. It all depends on you. Uh, you know, and for over here, I just want like clothing and I'm going to click on next. You can skip these questions if you want as well. So I'm going to go ahead and skip actually. And next, just fill in this form, your first name, your last name, your address and stuff like that. And then you are good to go. So I'm going to go ahead and fill this out and I'm going to catch you guys in a second. And boom, here you go. As you can see, I've created my account. Pretty simple. You get your trial and you can move on. So now let's go ahead and connect our store. So just choose the platform over here onto your Printful dashboard over here just simply choose shopify and connect all right so create your shopify account install the printful app on shopify and connect your store and add your products right pretty simple so let's go ahead and do that so over here we're on our shopify store now let's go ahead and click on apps and download the application and over here just simply click on view more apps in this collection and over here you will have all of these different applications so just search for an application that you are looking for so we're looking for printful so we'll go ahead and search for printful over here here we go we have our printful application over here and then we have our printful application over here just simply click on printful and it's going to open up the application all right just simply click on add app wait for a couple of seconds there you go and just simply click on install application now all you have to do is just connect your account so just simply continue and connect to my store boom there you go as you can see now our store is connected all i have to do now is just add product to these stores and i'm good to go and as you can see we have a bunch of different products to choose from you can choose whichever one you want so over here you have your new products you have my products import from store and warehouse items and stuff like that so just simply choose the product that you created over here for example this is the product that i want right now i have to choose the size i want to choose the medium xl all right i have the color let's go ahead and select the colors as well and now i can choose the size as well now i have colors i'm good to go now all i have to do is click on proceed to mockups all right so now we have all the mockups over here just choose the mockups that you want all right it all looks good so just simply click on proceed to details and now proceed to the uh, you know pricings and over here you have all of your pricing and it's pretty expensive so let's go ahead and uh drop it down to let's say like twenty dollars fly your retail price if must be higher all right so percentage here we go and then you can like you know set your price over here for i mean i know this is pretty um you know high price but you know it all depends on you so Next, what you want to do is just simply click on submit to store, wait for a couple of seconds for your product to be stored, and then you are good to go. And that is basically how you do it. That is how you connect your Shopify account to Printful and how you can add Printful to your Shopify account and how you can sell both of your products on both of these two applications. So having said that, thank you guys for watching and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you have any questions, let me know in the comment sections down below. Having said that, I will catch you guys in the next video and until then, take care and goodbye.